Richard Simmons has popped back on social media to thank his fans. Shortly after the premiere of TMZ's documentary about the fitness icon's public disappearance, the 74-year-old took to Facebook to share his appreciation for all the love. Along with a picture of a smiling face emoji holding up a big red thank you sign, Richard captioned the post in part, thank you everyone for your kindness and love with a red heart emoji before concluding with love Richard. The energetic endorphin filled personality spokesperson, Tom Esty also shared a statement with Access Hollywood that read in part, Richard is eternally grateful for the continuous outpouring of love and gratitude he has received from across the globe. He is happy, healthy, and living the life he has chosen to live. After decades in the spotlight, Richard suddenly stopped teaching at his famous Hollywood workout studio back on February 15th, 2014, and has not been seen in the public since. The mystery surrounding his public disappearance has been fueled by the hit podcast, Missing Richard Simmons, which has given rise to sensational rumors, which include that Richard is being held hostage in his Hollywood Hills home by his housekeeper, another that he is possibly transitioning into a woman, and other wild fan theories. In the recent documentary, which aired on Fox, TMZ analyzed the facts behind Richard's departure from the public eye by speaking to those who knew him best. The special featured interviews from Suzanne Summers, comedian Bruce Valanche, and Dr. Phil. Back in 2016, Richard did offer an explanation to his disappearance during a phone call in to the Today Show. I just sort of wanted to be a little bit of a loner for a while. You know, I had hurt my knee, Savannah, and I had um, some problems with it. Mm. And, you know, right now I just want to sort of, you know, just take care of me. Not long before Richard went into seclusion, he made an appearance on Access Hollywood and Howie Mandel cracked a joke which made Richard cry. Back in 2016, the America's Got Talent judge revisited Access Hollywood for an interview and he, Kit Hoover, and Billy Bush reminisced on that fateful day. Wait, and Howie was also here, I believe. Were you here the Richard Simmons day? You made yes. him no, no, mad. No, 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 was uh, he here? Yes. It's Wait, perhaps the most uh, he, I get a did he cry? monumental yeah. moment. What did you say to him, Howie? I don't know what I said. Look, look, look at this. Yeah. Please getting ready. Bring this up again. Howie's and then shortly ready. after this, he disappeared for two years. So Nice, Howie. Listen, here's where he drops the bomb. Howie drops. Are we on the air? We're on the air. Here it comes. <laughs> He's Richard, I think Howie needs a hug. He needs a hug. Oh, no, no, I don't want a hug. No, I don't think it's a man. Don't do it. Look at him. <laughs> so look at him. <laughs> That's something nobody needs to see. Oh my God. Well then. What then, happened? Oh, this was the greatest. Uh, this was the greatest day of TV I've ever been part of. Howie upsets Richard, but and that's not the part said. I like. It doesn't but matter. He upset. You, you said something. I like said it. something. He's very sensitive. You're helping. You're, you said uh, people go to you for advice or something like but that. But look at him. So then Richard gets upset, and we don't know if it's an act. You know, sometimes he does the I'm upset act. But this time he was legitimately upset, and Richard left. He walked off the set. Hiding. He went into the wardrobe closet, closed the door, <laughs> and he sat down. He wouldn't come out. So Can you I imagine that? That's got to be rough. When when Richard Simmons is in the closet, <laughs> that's something. <laughs> that's something that doesn't happen. He is. He's, he's usually right out of the closet. No, but I'm just saying the fact that he's well, in the I closet. Isn't get him he out. so sweet? He was he so sweet when you finally you sang and he came out. I and sang. I believe we ended in a group hug. We I live I sang sunshine on my shoulder and because that puts him in a and that's place. why he came out and then he came out <laughs> wow. and he came out. I think, I think still people Jackie are you. referencing a whole they're getting a whole different uh, image of what actually happened <laughs> from this story I <laughs> I sent him into the closet and your singing you, brought him out you need to air that whole and thing I said that whole thing again.